No, it's not a point they don't want to work. I'd love a job, me. I really would. You know what I mean? The amount of CVs and everything I've, I've given out over this last six to eight months is unbelievable. Um, I'm still under probation and everything, everything. And probation could even confirm the amount I've, I've done. And I've done odd jobs. I've gone self-employed as a car valet and things like that. But then with the weather changing, I had to stop. And I wasn't getting enough to survive. And I worked myself into the ground. And then, but every time I go for full-time employment, actually nine to five work, yeah, it, it's really hard because I'm a joiner, but there's 10 joiners to every job. And they're going to take the people that's just come out of work, not the people that's been out of work. You know what I mean? And there's no help to help you get back into work. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, they send you to winter serve. You know what I mean? And if you miss an appointment, they stop your money, and then you've got to go on hardship. And oh, that's a whole whole different topic. You know what I mean? So, but people, they're ignorant. That's why I put it down to ignorance. Because if if they could live it for themselves just for a week, their outlook on life would be totally different. You know what I mean? Or even let them go on benefits for a month. You know what I mean? Let them survive on two hundred eighty-eight pound a month. You know what I mean? So, yeah, it'd be a totally different story when they know they've got to pay the top up, the gas, the electric, the water, the council tax, the, gas, the food bill. Then they've got to keep yourself clothed, your toiletries, if you smoke. It's like I haven't been on a bus for about 18 months. I, I walk everywhere because I can't afford buses. That £1.30, that's a loaf of bread. Or it's a poor pie Or it's a dog food for a couple of days. And I'd rather buy that than get a bus. I'd rather walk. If I have to set off an hour earlier, I'll set off an hour earlier. It's a subject that's so far front in my mind and you know, I can go on about it for you because it is, it's a big part of my life. If I wasn't on benefits, oh, I'd love it. I'd love a nine to five job, but for the time being, I, I just, oh, there's nothing else I can do apart from the best I can with what I've got, which is not a lot.